Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to Texas TV Show, and today, guys, I'm going to be trying to draw an easy little beach scene using my brand new tone tan sketch paper. So, if you did see my last video, I tested this out. I'm currently filming it literally five minutes after that. Thank goodness. I got the seascape set of colored pencils and I want to draw a seascape with it. So that's what we're doing. I don't have anything else to do with my life right now. So I do have a reference up. It's an easy drawing. I don't really want to go crazy with this. To be honest, I'm lazy. Like I said, bye block. This is like the foam stuff. Okay. I don't like it. Oh my god. So I might not get the colors exactly how the reference is, but at the same time, I'm not trying to make this perfect. I'm just, I'm just kind of drawing and testing things out, to be honest. But I still am using the reference as like, where things go. What we're doing. So there's a sky in this drawing, but I'm just kind of going to dip the ocean because I don't want to draw a sky. So this is literally a minimalistic drawing of a beach. Like, there's no waves in the ocean at all. Like, I'm not going crazy complex. I'm just kind of drawing. And I will get back to the magic video soon because that was one of my highly requested things. So I'm just trying to do quick, easy videos so I can kind of get back into the groove of recording on a decently often basis. Now that I'm feeling better from sickness, I still have stomach ache every now and then. But I was COVID negative. We tested, I was negative. We think it was food poisoning, or just overeating too much food, but I'm fine now. Clearly, I mean, I've uploaded a couple days in a row now. I uploaded twice, 26th, I think it was. Yeah, twice on the 26th. One was just that, like, most viewed video 2021, because I saw a lot of people doing that, and I really wanted to do it. Especially since that video got like 55,000 views or something crazy like that. So I kind of wanted to revisit that with all of y'all. Then I used my Ving Light for the first time yesterday. I mean, 26th, sorry, I'm recording this it's currently 27th. So it was yesterday for me. And then yesterday I uploaded a long video, long video of testing out all the Zod supplies. And then 
also uploaded that title video by Megan Trainor, that kiss my butt goodbye. It says a bad word, but I know that it's a bad word, so I'm not going to say a bad word. Because I'm not going to break rules just for YouTube. At least that's not who I am. I'm not a rule breaker. Okay, the pink hair is going away soon, by the way, everybody. I am a competition dancer, and then I want to have... Um, unnaturally colored hair for competitions, which understandable. So I will not have pink in a couple weeks, which I'm a little sad about to be honest. But it's fine. I knew I knew that was gonna happen. So I might re dye pink next year. I'm thinking I might bleach all my hair and do pink tips then, or I might not bleach all my hair and do tips but not pink, maybe? No, not yet, but pink is leaving soon. Very soon. I think, like, it's 27th currently. It's 28th for you guys, so... Should be leaving sometime January, early January. I don't know when, obviously, or if I give you a date, but just be prepared to uh, not have pink. I'm actually gonna somewhat blend this. Not really trying very hard right now, and my flap is turned off. Yeah, this is not going to be exact because it has, like, the reflection of the sun in the water. And, like, the glare you get from the water and the sun, which you're not going to have because it's not going to be a sun. Because I'm not doing a sun. I'm lazy. Just being honest at this point, like, I'm lazy and don't feel like doing anything. I don't know, I've been up for, like, an hour and then my daughter's record videos, so... Turn off. Tired. So I'm gonna have the beach cut it here. And it's gonna cut off. I know there's a chair on the beach with an umbrella, but I'm not going to draw a chair. This has perspective in it, but I suck at the perspective. This is giving me a very flat ocean. At least I'm honest, like, I'm just gonna be honest. This is actually a video, I'm not watching the video, I'm just going off of, like, the thumbnail. I think it's a video, to be honest, I don't know, but... It is so hot in here. My fan's on, but I'm still wearing all black and long sleeves. Oh no, that's not, I'm, I've gone, I got four Funhouse shirts for Christmas, so for the next, like, week and a half, I'm going to be wearing nothing but Funhouse shirts, just, just as a heads up. 25th, I wore a Funhouse shirt, 26th, I wore a Funhouse shirt, 27th, I'm wearing a Funhouse shirt, and tomorrow I'm going to wear my blue one. Very excited, very exciting, love it. I am currently losing my mind. My phone turned off again. But that's okay because I'm just walking on sand. Very undetailed sand. I am going to lose my mind. I'm still walking on a small little area. I still have that whole little area over there. I can't seem to save my life. I'm really miserable. I can see so, so, so lowest. I can see in a group. 
much. I might cut this video off shorter if I can show up because I'm not gonna get in trouble, but like, I don't feel like talking on camera with my family home. My brother's home. I don't know where the heck he is, to be honest. I think he's in his room watching, watching TV. Sometimes my videos just end early because parents get home. Like, they know I have a channel. I guess they wouldn't have bought me a ring light without a reason, and they know I have a channel. Especially since actually one week ago on Monday, uh, we were in the car, and I blurted out, well, I have 746 subscribers on my channel. Because he was talking about, let me know when you guys have like a million followers and stuff. It's like... Okay, you wanna play this game? <laughs> I didn't mean to blurt it out, but it's just gonna happen. Like, and I was sick at that point, I was kinda just like chilling in the car. Underneath the blanket, curled up into a ball. Half awake. We were out looking at Christmas lights. So I'm killing this pencil. <laughs> Had these for two days! Actually, three days because my parents bought me these. And they were on Christmas Eve because we opened all of our family gifts on Christmas Eve. That's our tradition. Christmas Eve, our family usually comes over and we all open each other's gifts, we exchange gifts, and then the next day, Santa brings our gifts. Which, we have to my loadout for freaking funhouse shirts. Yeah, no, I only had, like, four Funhouse shirts to begin with. Actually, like, one of the times, back in May, I went to Hawaii, and we were gonna be gone for a week, and I considered just packing nothing but Funhouse shirts and my bathing shirt. That would have been enough to last me a whole week. But, but I advised against it. I, I kept myself. But you see, I have this... Other long sleeve shirt that you guys have seen me wear many times. And it is very comfy, and I usually wear that when we have long road trips or when we're going on an airplane or something. And that's what I did both on the way there and back. I wore my long sleeve funhouse shirt on the plane. It got washed in between and all that. I'm just like, this is the comfiest shirt I got that is in like sweatpants. I'm like, I'm not getting torn sweatpants. Your girl is nowhere near against wearing sweatpants. Sweatpants. I love sweatpants. That's my opinion. But also, I'm... I like the comfiness of sweatpants. Naturally, these pants I'm wearing right now have a giant hole on me. But I couldn't find any other black pants because for some reason, all my clothes just keep disappearing. Like, I know I got more clothes than this. Like the other day I got out of the shower and I went to go get into go get dressed for bed, all that fun stuff. And I didn't have any shirts to sleep in. I found blue pants that went with my panda and red like red plaid pants that go with a Christmas shirt that I had that I sleep in. Oh, oh. All jammies, all jammies, and I'm just like, I don't have shirts to either of these. So I, like, that, I don't have clothes, what's going on? So I got into new pants that I had gotten literally that morning, and my funhouse shirt, I got into my blue firefly funhouse shirt. So I haven't worn that in like a week. That one has a hole in it, to be honest. Which sucks, but at the same time, I've only had it for a year. It's funny. I've had the blue funhouse shirt for a little over a year now. And that one has a hole in it. But I have this black one that doesn't have a hole in it. And I've had that for two years. Actually, I wore the 26th as a, um, remembering that that was my first time I ever wore that shirt. 26th. December 26, 2019. People think I'm a freak because, like, I can memorize dates. 
Like, we were having some conversation at some salon, I think, and my mom was getting her hair done, and I went with her, and she's just like, I don't know where it came up, but we were talking about, like, how I love seafood and crab and all that, and how my mom can't eat any of it. So I just wanted to strain from the reference of just doing random, like, colors, but they all gonna look good. And I remember I blurted out the last time I had had crab, which was, at that time, was, um, June 19th, 2020, I believe. And I remember me and my dad had to deal, I would feel needles, and if I had had, if I needed to have my blood drawn at the doctor's that day, he would give me Joe's crab check. Had to have my blood drawn, so I got Joe. I got some crab. I got my 13 at the time when I got Joe's crab check that day. And the fact that I remember that over a year later was like, what the heck is wrong with me? Like, I remember dates. Which is funny, because a lot of people say, oh, you know dates, you are good with numbers, so you should be good at math, right? Not really. I finished the school year with like a 91 in math, which is good. I have I, straight A's, straight A student. I'm a good student. And, um, they're just like, oh, you should be really good with math. I'm not. I'm really not. Math is not my strong suit. I'm actually really good with English. I enjoy writing and reading. And I actually asked for the handbook for the recently deceased for Christmas. I got it. My dad on Christmas Eve is just like, does that even exist? I'm just like, yeah, I googled it. I looked it up. It exists. I wanted it. It was on my list. And I got it. It wasn't like a joke present. It was like, I legitimately want it. And I found out that there were two versions I could get. One was like a, um, 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 one that's empty, blank, and you can write whatever you want in it, and the other actually has words in it. I got one with words. Just like, I don't care which one I get. I just want it. Between YouTube, I can use it for YouTube, and just for my personal enjoyment, I want that thing. I got it. Don't know how the heck I got it, but I got it. That's just like, does that even exist? Is that even a real thing? I'm just like, yeah, it is. It is. And we're at another 20 minute video because I lost like a time and I was not planning on doing another 20 minute video. I keep looking out the window because I hear music and I think my dad's home. <laughs> So I'm kind of speeding through this part because I haven't want to finish this video. But if I do just end the video, I'll upload a short later on about it. Because of, well, I just don't like recording one at home, I guess. It's just like something to do with like, every time I'm on my phone and I start typing, I, um, even if I'm not messaging someone, my mom is just like, who are you messaging? And half the time I'm not messaging anyone, half the time I'm like Googling something. And it comes out being insane. And I play Fortnite and I'm always the only female in every lobby. It kind of drives me insane. Thankfully I haven't had any freakouts like, oh my god, I'm playing with a girl. But like, I usually... The other day I was playing Fortnite and I was playing the imposters mode and I was just chilling there and I was using the voice one. So I had a headset on and I was just like, who are you talking to? Are you playing with friends? Mind you, it's almost midnight. She's like, no, I'm playing with strangers. None of my friends are awake. She's like, I don't know any of these people. I might know them, but I don't. Like, I could know them for all I know. Like, I don't know what is. Sorry. I could know them. It could have been one of you guys while I knew, but like, I don't know that. I don't know if any of you guys play Fortnite. I just like use you guys as, as an example. Like, I don't know these people in real life. Unless, like, they're friends and I don't know their usernames. 
I have no idea who these people are. So this is a very awful ocean. I wasn't really doing good on it. Like, it's just I'm bored and I wanted to attempt to draw an ocean. It's called I'm bored and I wanted content. <laughs> I'm kidding. I just wanted an excuse to draw, and YouTube is usually my excuse to draw. Being honest here, like, if I am art block, I will somehow end up recording a video and making up as I like the little one. That's my specialty. So if I ever start up a video, like, I have no idea what I'm doing, it's because I don't know what I'm doing and I'm making up as I go along. Which either works out or it turned out awfully. I don't know sometimes. Like, sometimes I will record an amazing 20 minute video. Other times I will record a 2 minute video that was awful. But this blue patch was not going well. But yeah, I drew an ocean. It's not my best. I've drawn way better oceans, to be honest. I should have been When I was taking art classes, I still do. But here's the ocean. Whenever we had an art project, I would usually paint. Because at the time, I couldn't draw. So at the time, I was like so dead set on drawing realistic things. It wasn't my art style. I'm not a realistic drawer. I'm not. But at the time, I didn't know that. So I would always paint. Because painting was my strong suit. And I would always do some sort of like landscape. Like a, I would usually do waterfall with grass and hills around it. But that was like my go-to. And only recently did I start branching out of that. Actually, one of my last art things of 8th grade I did a painting but it wasn't landscape. I did two. One was landscape and the other was Among Us. <laughs> and I was like, I'm finally doing some other than landscapes. Just like, I want to do my strong suit landscapes and something else. I did. I don't think my parents are home. My dog hasn't gone running down the stairs like a crazed animal. But yeah, no, I would always go to my main go-to landscapes. Because I was discouraging myself because I didn't I didn't know my art style. I realized that I'm more of a cartoony stylist. Don't mind me. <laughs> I can draw realistically sometimes. It takes me forever. But you guys have seen some of my drawings. I feel like my best was Burnt Fiend. I don't know why. But my best was the Burnt Fiend. <laughs> I was obsessed with that. I didn't sleep for like a week. I stared at that face way too long. God, I was up for like two hours just staring at it. Like, it's not like, oh, I look down and I get like, no, I'm staring at a picture and then I'm looking down and drawing that. Like, ugh, way too much. But it came out good. I was proud of it. But yeah, I was always like discouraged myself because I couldn't draw realistically and I would always end up drawing a stick figure. I'm just like, I would always get a hundred, not hundred, I would usually get an A. Like, it just wasn't my thing. But now I know practice makes perfect. And I will post the uh, 2021 Rewind, and I will have my first drawing to my newest drawing, not the ocean, my theme to at the this point in time, Brody. I don't know, I might draw somebody else between now and the 31st, but I doubt I will because I was in four days. Yeah, four days. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. Three days of the video, but as of recording, it is the 27th. But yeah, if you guys did enjoy today's video, make sure you go down below, hit that like button, and if you are new to my channel, make sure you hit that red subscribe button and hit the little bell icon, never miss an upload. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys!